Good morning, Pastor students and staff. Today is Tuesday, February 20th, 2024. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. At this time, we'll recognize a moment of silence. Thank you, everyone. Our announcements for today are as follows. Spring pictures will take place Wednesday, that's tomorrow. All students will take spring pictures and it is a free dress day. If you're interested in purchasing pictures, please see details on how to do so. This Wednesday, that's also tomorrow, will be an early dismissal day. Students will be released at the early dismissal time of one o'clock. Students, please be sure to remind your parents. Our final Friday event will take place this Friday with an ice cream social. Kindergarten through second grade students must purchase the event with dojo points. Third through eighth grade students must have a valid pride card. This month's student of the month celebration will take place this Friday in the Pastor Gym. Teachers, please be sure to enter the name of your student of the month by end of day tomorrow, that's Wednesday, so certificates may be printed. That does conclude our announcements for today. Our words of wisdom are on choices. Good morning, Pastor Pride. This is Mrs. Acosta with a few words of wisdom. Here's another story from Aesop's Fables. It's called The Boar and the Fox. A boar is a wild pig with tusks like an elephant's. A boar uses his tusks to protect himself from hunters and other animals that might try to hurt him. One day, the boar was sharpening his tusks on a tree when a fox came by. The boar was working so very hard that the tree and all of the bushes around were shaking. The fox said, my goodness, you are working hard to sharpen your tusks, but there's no one around who wants to hurt you. To that, the boar replied, well, if I wait until something tries to attack me, there'll be no time to sharpen my tusks. I must get them ready now so they will be of good use to me when I need them. So what's the moral of this story? It's important to make choices today so you will be ready for tomorrow. Like choosing to study for a test today so you will be ready to do well on it tomorrow. Or choosing to brush your teeth tonight so you don't have cavities in the future. Today, remember the boar and the fox and make choices today that will help you to be your very best tomorrow. With something to think about, this is Mrs. Acosta. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. Have a wonderful Tuesday, Pastor.